Yo guys, what's going on? Zace is here today with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to farm impact grenades here in Escape from Tarkov. Impact grenades are going to be your key to success when it comes to the Grenadier task this wipe and Grenadier locks 762 BP. So having that task done and unlocking that BP ammo is going to help you out, especially towards that mid wipe. Guys, make sure you leave it a like and of course, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Let's hop right in this guide, man. So we're going to be heading on factory with our scav. Now, don't get me wrong. You can do this on your PMC. You're just going to have to fight through your spawn and hope you get a decent spawn. And, you know, if you like playing factory, I guess this is fine. But at the same time, it's so much easier on the scav. Really, there's no PMCs on the map. You just have other scavs. And 90% of the other scavs on the map aren't going to shoot you unless you find a rogue. And hopefully you can still shit on his ass. But at the end of the day... Factory scavs are the easiest way to farm impact grenades. And we're going to be hitting that grenade case in the underground expansion area. So let's hop in raid and I'll show you exactly what to do. All right, we're in. We're going to head underground immediately. I'm just kind of stay away from everybody, to be honest. We're going to be heading right for that grenade crate. There's also a technical supply crate down there that you guys can hit if you want. Usually has some pretty decent loot if it's not looted. Um, so it's just a little bit of bonus profit. We got a party down here. Another guy right there. It's a player, but we're here for this right here. The grenade box. What do we got? We got a VOG, another VOG, and an F1. Hey, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. He's looting that. We got some homies right here. But that's all we have to do. Just keep farming that grenade box and see if you get an impact grenade. Now, the beauty of it is, is when you don't get an impact grenade... You're still getting other decent grenades that you can then take into your raid, use on a PMC on factory, use those nades, see if you can grab a grenade kill. If you can't, then hopefully within the next five minutes or so, you're going to have your scav ready again. You go grab some more grenades and you literally never have to buy grenades for Grenadier. But this is the best way to farm for those impacts. So we're going to do some more scav runs and see how many we can get. All right. Go get ourselves an impact grenade, baby. Mm. Run it up. It's that easy. There you go. I get them like one in three raids, to be completely honest. They're about one in three. That's pretty much it, man. You can get both out of that crate. You can get the RGN and the RGO. They are basically the same thing. I think one might have a very slight variance. Let me see. Yeah, one has a, a difference in the fragment count, and the other one has a difference in the damage per fragment. But um, at the end of the day, if you're hitting that impact grenade, you're going to be getting that kill. One has a little more range as well on the explosion radius, but... If you're landing that nade right on them, you're going to be good to go regardless. Having impact nades is going to make your life so much easier for Grenadier. And uh, hopefully you guys learned something and you found this guide helpful. Hopefully you get a couple extra impacts and get that task done a little bit sooner. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, sponsors, and equipment description below. It's going to be it for me. Thank you for stopping by. I'm out.